Hello and welcome. I hope you guys and girls are well and enjoying your day. What have you up to? And you join me here on Farming Simulator 2022 for a mod showcase. Yes, mod showcase number two. This is closely linked to the first one, which is a sawmill. And the animated sawmill is made by the same modders. Um, this is version... It's known as just Palette Productions. Um, it's version one of this mod. Um... Of course, I will leave the links down below for you guys and girls to download it. But do download it at your own risk and try it on a, on a practice or dummy map before putting it onto your main save game map. Um, that way, if it does break your game, it doesn't break anything important to you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Um, same, like I said, same modders that made the animated sawmill. Um, this is version one of it. So if you're watching this at a later date and there's a newer version available, do please bear that in mind. But everything is animated. The door is animated, as you can see. There's details around all the pump trucks. You've got the uh, tip points here. I think you can even grab these cones. You can. Move them around, throw them around. You can. Um, again, come through here. And then there's a little office in here. And the lights... There's the lights in here. I think it's behind this door from every side, right? Shut the door again. Um, yep, there they are. No, no. I want to go to the light. That's it. I'll go clockwise round. Sorry, I've got to let the sun to eat. So. Oops, clicked on it twice. Come on, open door. Open system again. Doors animated. Very good, very good detail inside here. Um, then you've got that, which is like the welcome to, and it's the sawmill. I can hardly just read that. Um, you can illuminate it as well. I shut this door again. There you go. It does look a bit too over TT though. Um, and then if you come down here, you see all these robots all sitting here. Don't worry, I'll show you what they all do. Down here, there's lights for this main bit. And then again, this door opens and shuts, as you can see. Uh, quickly pop over here. Through this set of doors. And this is like a little shop. Where I guess people can come and buy the pallets from if they really wanted to. Again, there's a switch here. These doors do open. I can't figure out what's the back end, what's the front of this. I say this is back because the ladder was... Or the, or the, or the actual... I say ladder the stairs. Um, you don't really want the stairs on the front of the building because then people just can wander up to the stairs and whoever. And then you've got the stack there, smokestack, roof. Don't think you can climb the ladder. No, you can't. And then I jump off and break my legs. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to have the sawmill mod this to work as long as whatever map you use is um produces the materials this needs um i think you're good to go but don't quote me on that you may need to test it first the plants you can if you've got super strength off you can pick the plants up chairs are non-movable that's non-movable but anyway i digress let me show you what you need to get this from a cold and dark um, thing. Let, before I show you what you need, if I can get out of the door, let me show you where you find it in the shop first. Once you have downloaded it and installed it and tested it, obviously, you find it under... Oh, wrong one. You find it under construction. And then if you go to production, go all the way over to this one. And there you go. Um, it's quite a big plot. Um, I would recommend put it on somewhere flat and make sure it's on flat land first um, before placing it. Um, you can, it does have the option to... I don't think it has the options to oops, change the colour or anything. Um, but bear in mind, I've placed it just roughly here and it looks it's made a dent in my ground. So just be careful how you place it. Make sure you're wherever land you place it on is nice and flat. For it to go uh but anyway that uh, i digress 
let me show you how this um, thing works and what you need. So first of all, need wood beams. Those will go here. Like so. And again, I'm just grabbed again. Imagine I'm using a tractor, not got super strength. Just for demonstration purposes. And then you see they appear there. Like so. And then short planks, they come round here. Like so. Again, again, just for sub demonstration purposes. Shove another one down in there, and you can see another pallet appears. Like so. And then you need long planks. So grab them. And they come around here to get your teddy hand or whatever you want to do from around here. Again, the triggers are quite accessible. We just need to drive close to them. And they should start popping in there. Again, same thing again. Throw that in just to demonstrate to you. It does work. Right, and then once you've got it all going if you go find you'll find it in the abductions facility pallet factory and as you can see let me just buy a bit more just to put it into green should do for demonstration purposes again um, and then you can activate it one of two ways you can either come in here and come up to this and then activate it that way um, or press R on it and activates it through there and then if I show you what's going on look that little robots cutting up all the timber and it slowly pushes it through. And then you see this robot starts to construct it. Very methodically starts to construct the pallet for you. Again, don't do this at home, kids, with real robots. Don't go anywhere near a factory with robots like this. Again, you see that one cutting the planks again. There's more and more planks come down. And then slowly, surely, this robot then starts putting the pallet together. like so and that's the pallet and it comes over to this next robot which then picks it up drops it down and then over time you'll find that the pallet starts to spawn here see that just despawn from there but over time you'll find it starts spawning here anyway while that's doing that let's quickly walk over here show you the other bits now there's the little shop um, this woman's just sitting here waiting to sell pallets to get people, I guess, as they come and go. I want some pallets, please. Yes. And then you can use the pallets that this produces to go back into the sawmill. Um, if you do have that animated sawmill. And then this dude sitting here doing, just supervising. Cameras making sure they're all doing the funky thing. Make sure the robots are all doing their thing. No one's stealing anything from the yard. Some other little uh, bits and pieces going on in the background. Again, you can come into here. Don't know if you can cut the power from here. No, you can't. Wonder if you can cut it through him. No. But I'll quickly show you outside while that's do it. still doing its funky thing. Uh, are we on the right side? Yes. If I come up here. come up here a bit more 
You can see the smoke pluming from the chimney. Yay. That gives you an idea if it's still running or not from a... Not a so far, but... You can definitely see the flashing lights there. If you're a photo um be careful of this one. Um, it's all right while the main lights are on. It's not that bad, but... As you can see, it's pretty good. I think it's quite good. As I said, it was very good on this. Dude's doing his thing. And over time, if I can get through the door. That's the only thing I, can, I found. It can glitch through the... You can't fit through the doors very well, but... As you can see, it slowly over time produces pallets. And if I fast forward time... The animation doesn't go any quicker, but the producing of pallets does. And then, then you can have it so it's storing, or you can have it so it's, again, you can change it so it distributes it back to the, to your um, other depot. Click over a bit longer. As you can see it's slowly storing more and more pallets up. And then you can come in here, grab your forklift truck, stack your pallets, do all that funky thing. And that concludes the mod showcase peeps as you can see i let me just quickly go around a bit um more building more pallets building more pallets that's waiting for more wood to be cut stuff like that but as again as i said it's quite an in-depth little uh mod showcase um i hope you guys and girls enjoyed it if you did please feel free to like if you didn't enjoy it for any reason any reason at all please feel free to dislike Please leave comments down below. Oops, wrong button. So I'm aware, and you can, I can try to improve in future videos. If you know anyone else that may also enjoy watching this, guys and girls, and feel this, find this useful as a mod, um, please feel free to share. It helps me out. I don't mind you sharing. And if you're new to my channel, we'll see future episodes of this or anything else that I'm working on. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you're aware as soon as I upload a new video. I'll see you in the next one. TTFN.